before and after. <laughs> you gotta be fit to be in showbiz. I'm gonna play you another new song. Oh, he's full of them tonight. <laughs> It's a little bit thirsty up here. <laughs> Did you hear about the Irishman who thought Sugar Davides was a Greek boxer? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he thought that condescending was a Greek parachutist. <laughs> mm -hmm. You know, I heard a wonderful story, and it's a true story. <laughs> this was told to me by an Irishman, uh, a guy named Martin O'Connor, and uh, he said there was a, a, an Irish guy who had three beautiful daughters, and uh, they were all very close in age, and when they got to be in their mid to late teens, they started going out together and going to parties and all that sort of stuff and getting home later and later and later all the time and started to really worry him. So he thought he better lay down the law. So he's waiting there at the breakfast table and the girls come down and they're all giggling and carrying on and he's got his newspaper and he throws it down. He goes, right, you three are a fine pair if ever there was one. <laughs> he said, it was today when you got home last night, and if it's tomorrow when you get home tonight, you'll have to look for somewhere else to live if you want to stay here. <laughs> and that's the true story.